there's not a lot written on my subject matter, so I have to go searching to new and interesting places. A PhD project is a really creative thing and I think the British Library is good for finding those little bits of the jigsaw puzzle where there was a gap. There are certain resources which only the British Library has and certainly it provided a lot of detailed sources on things which I couldn't find anywhere else. I'm looking at 18 Pacific films and analyzing them and seeing how these new films are representative both of their Spanish culture and also what international influences can be seen. It's very important to me to be able to access books and articles on a huge number of subjects in the most convenient way possible, which is why I love coming to the British Library. I kind of found myself coming here more and more as I got deeper into my PhD. I was trying to research the artistic landscape of the capital of Crete during the Venetian period. There were the maps, there were the plans, there were the views. They all kind of wove together to create a picture of what the lost city was like. My research looks at the development of public weather services and how certain extreme weather events have affected how they deliver these services and how the public sort of view these services as well. One of the newspapers and records that I've used at the British Library is, is coverage from the Great Storm of 1987. The records there of the storm have really helped give me an insight into that event. Without the books and pamphlets and newspapers, the research and the outcomes of, of the findings of my, of my project wouldn't have been the same. I feel like I've discovered things and put together a picture of things which hasn't been done before. I could basically say I could not write my thesis without having this library. It would have taken me twice as long. The British Library is going to just continue to be a central resource for me.